Good morning, students. Once again, welcome you all for the EBS class. Dear students, already we have started learning about lesson number two, my body. Is it? Dear students, we have already started learning about lesson number two, my body. Dear students, in the previous class, first part, the name of different names of the parts of body we have learned. Is it? So. From that, already I have given you homework that you have to send a uh, mist stand in front of the mirror and you deliver body part waves. Is it? So many of the students have sent me the homework that is good. But remaining students also send the homework daily. Is whatever the homework we are uh, at the end of the video class, we are giving one homework. That homework should be completed by you and send it to the WhatsApp number. Okay, students. So here, uh, body parts have different names that we have learned. So head, hand, leg, ears, nose, mouth, lips, feet, tongue, chest, stomach, legs, knee, foot, toes, fingers. Is it? These are all things we have learned. So our body parts have different names. Okay, dear students. With this, we have learned about the uses of parts of body. Dear students, uses of parts of body means means whatever the work you are doing. So you are taking a means with the help of body part you are doing that work. For example, if you are talking, how you are talking with the help of your mouth. Is it with the help of mouth, tongue? You are talking to others. If you want to hear the sound, so which body part you are using? Ears. With the help of ears, we are hearing the uh, sound. Is it? Dear student, just you are seeing ah, the rose is red color. The flower, the marigolds are yellow color. Champa is light yellow color. Is it? The leaves or plants are in green color. You are telling or no? So how you will recognize these colors, uh, different colors? Uh, whatever if your friends wearing different color dress, you will say that is a red dress, blue dress, white dress. You are telling or no? So how you will recognize these colors? Yes, with the help of eye. With the help of, we will recognize the color. Sometimes we will tell that uh, that uh, animal is very small, it is very long, snake is very long, is it? So this shape and size also we are recognizing. How we are recognizing? With the help of our eyes, we will recognize the color, shape, size, it is near or far, everything will be recognized by our ears, is it? These eyes are used to see the surrounding. Dear student, you are playing many games, is it? Whenever you are playing, running, jumping, walking, is it? So, which body part you are using here? Can you tell me? For running, walking, jumping, skipping, is it? So, which body parts are using here? Yes, dear student, with the help of legs, we are walking, we are running, jumping, skipping. So, your legs are using to do the things. Then dear student, you are writing, eating means taking a bite of food to mouth, from the plate to mouth. Who is helping here? Hands. With the help of hands, fingers, you will hold the bite of food and taking it near to the mouth. Is it dear student? Then who will chew the food? Your teeth are helping, tongue is helping. Is it? So to chew the food here, teeth are helping and tongue is also helping. So with the help of hands, fingers, mouth, teeth, tongue, we are eating the food. So these are the parts of body here using to get the food. Okay dear student, again just you think, suppose you are doing some drawing work. You are doing some drawing work, you are coloring the drawing. So which body part you are using here? Yes, dear students. Yes, with the help of hands, fingers, you will draw the figure, color the figure. And here eyes are also helping to 
give the colors red color blue color yellow color is it so here with the help of body parts we are doing the work yes dear student you are all doing claps so how you are doing claps with the help of both the hand you will do a clap okay dear student then if teachers are giving you to write the work so write one page copywriting so how you are which body part you are using to write the copywriting here dear students yes with the help of hands and fingers you will do the writing work understand all of you yes dear students so these are the uses of body parts dear students with the help of this we have learned about our hand is it we have five uh, we have fingers and thumb on each hand so how many hands do you have here here we are having two hands and in each hand we are having fingers and thumb on each hand and each finger has its special name each finger has a special name so the finger that stand apart is known as the thumb yes this is the uh, this is the finger that stand apart is known as the thumb and next to the thumb is pointer finger you may call it as index finger also okay index finger or pointer finger okay dear student and in uh, just you hold your hand like this which is the tallest finger here the middle one is it just you see here this is the middle finger and it is tallest here and the tallest finger is called as middle finger okay dear student first one second one third one and it is in the middle and it is the tallest one so you are calling it as a middle finger okay dear student then the next finger is which one this one so you count it is at what number first second third fourth so fourth one is the ring finger okay this finger is called as ring finger this fourth finger name is ring finger okay dear student after that last one yes compare to all this is a little one is it compare to all fingers this is little one and this is called a little finger or baby finger understand all of you this is called the little finger or baby finger okay dear student so this is about our hand now dear student just to look down to your legs yes here at the end of your foot the each foot has five toes just you see look at your legs just you look at your legs at the end of the foot the each leg has five toes okay so the largest toe is called a big toe and the smallest toe is called little toe okay dear student so these are the uh, names of fingers in hands and legs understand all of you so dear student these all things already we have learned in the previous class after this after that dear student we have learned about the part of face so this is called a face and in this also here many parts are there and they are having the separate names okay dear student here in the face there are two eyes how many eyes we have two eyes means we have two eyes okay and again in this only we are having here ears how many ears do we have then one and two here two ears are there okay and this part is called cheeks okay this part is called cheeks and cheeks below my forehead look round and red the mouth above my chin makes me talk and grin okay dear student so these two are called our lips these are called our teeth this is our tongue okay and these are our cheeks this is our chin Yes, so these are all the parts of our face. Okay, and with the help of eyes, we can see the surroundings. 
with the help of ears we can hear the sound in the face here our nose is there okay dear student this is our nose and how many nose you are having only one nose okay we are having one nose and what is the use of this nose we can with the help of nose we can smell the things we can smell and recognize the things for example if some flowers are there you will see take the smell and you will recognize these are mogra flowers rose flowers you will recognize which flower smell the smell is there after that you can see the vegetables many vegetables like garlic ginger onion yes that also with the help of nose you can recognize the vegetable particular vegetable okay dear student so uh, these are means with the help of nose we can see the means we can feel the smell we can recognize the smell okay dear student after that we have learned about our sense organs okay sense organs means we can feel the things okay like how many sense organs are there here total our body has five sense organs okay we sense different things with our five sense organs okay which are the five sense organs here dear students eyes are the sense organs then nose is a sense organ means five there are uh, sense, sense organs just you think with the help of eyes we can see is it with the with the eyes we can see the surrounding so it it will use the sense of seeing then next part is our nose with the help of nose we can recognize the smell is it so nose will give the sensation of smelling okay next ears ears will give the sensation about hearing whatever the sound is coming we can recognize the sound then the student tongue about the tongue yes you can taste many things like hot cold sour is it salty so these things you can recognize with the help of your tongue okay dear student next is about our skin skin is also a sense organ how dear student dear student just uh, take some ice cubes from your refrigerator and hold it in the hand what do you feel yes you feel very cold because ice ice cubes are very cold then you take uh, you just uh, whenever you just go to the kitchen and your mother is preparing food and she kept a cooker there cooker cooker uh, cooker you know all of you your mother is preparing or cooking rice in the cooker just uh, uh, you touch the cooker after preparing the rice just you touch the cooker How, what do you feel it's very hot yes who will give this sensation our skin yes hot cold whatever the sensation who will give this our skin by the skin we can understand the hot cold soft hard hard things is it just you hold a rock in your hand rock rock understand you just hold a rock in your hand what do you feel it is very hard in another hand you take some petals of flowers how you feel they are very smooth is it so who will give this feeling who will give this sensation skin skin will give this sensation hard soft cold hot okay dear student so these are about the sense organs there are five sense organs eyes nose ear tongue and skin these are our five sense organs okay dear student so here some sentences have given already i have completed these sentences in the previous class only so complete the sentences we dash we cover eyes dear student what work do we are doing by eyes we can see we cover eyes then we dash we cover nose we smell we cover nose we dash we cover tongue we taste we cover tongue we dash we cover skin we feel with our skin we dash with the ears 
we can hear the sound with our ears okay dear student so this is the revision of lesson number 2 my body dear student after completing each lesson we are thinking to take the test okay that also online test we want to take so dear student today i have given the revision of this lesson and uh, in the coming days means we will inform you before one day that we are conducting the test so dear student so first lesson already i have completed and i have solved the evaluate part in the next class once again i will do the revision of first lesson then i will conduct the test dear student after uh, miss till here today we stop in the end of lesson one homework i will tell you just you recognize the different name parts of body names okay the names of body parts so in front of your parents or sisters or brothers just you say your body part names this is the homework for you okay dear student till here today we stop in the next class i will solve this evaluate part thank you